Lions here, Collectibles here, and today we're going to be reviewing the 2017 SummerSlam Elite Mankind. So, uh, we'll get a closer look at the accessories and we'll get right into reviewing Mankind. So here are the three accessories that he comes with. One is the, uh, I think this is the World Heavyweight Championship. That, that also came with uh, Mr. McMahon, the Mr. McMahon uh, WWE Network Spotlight figure, Sam built. And then he comes with Mr. Sacco, which is actually pretty cool. You just slide it right over his hand, just like that. This looks pretty good, pretty detailed. And then, as you can see, here he has no mask because the mask it comes on him in the uh, box but it is removable and I'll show you how to put it on in a second. So to get the main kind mask on, let me just remove this. So you take him oh yeah, so he does have a pretty good face sculpt. So you did take the mask, just plop it on his face like that. Not like that, but more like this. So in the back, you see he has this, like, uh, seamed area. Just take these little uh, pieces and you slide it under his hair. Right over there. It stays in place. Make sure it's on his face pretty good. You take this piece, also put it under his hair. And then Mankind is ready to go. So this is a SummerSlam exclusive because of this reason. Yes, um... Pretty much just because his uh, Mankind's first ever title win, he won it at SmackDown. So there's an image right here. Um, so uh, yeah, that's pretty much why it was a a SummerSlam uh, figure. So let's just get into the head sculpt. And this is sick. The mask came out good a little bit. You can just fix it sometimes. But. Hair came out good, the mask comes out pretty good. And the tie, he's got it, the Attitude Era um, uh, WWE logo. It won't uh, focus, there we go. He's got like this normal shirt on, normal pants, normal shoes. His arms sticking out. So overall, this is a badass figure. So articulation, not really that great on this because the hair blocks it a lot same with looking down gets blocked a lot he does have a little bit of ab crunch it's, it's under he goes that far that far back arm can go this far Move forward and back uh he also can turn his uh turn his arm up and down here Wrist is hinged up and down, swivel, then his legs, you can kick out that far, kick forward that far, kick back only a little bit, uh, so then he's got swivel at the top of his leg, double jointed knee, uh, a little bit of boot rotation over here. And then he has a tiny bit of ankle pivot. So here's Cactus Jack next to Mankind. So where's the two? Two of the faces of Foley. Probably the most uh most known. Um out of four, I think. I'm not sure. But pretty much they're like same height. He looks a little bit taller, but everything else seems to be like in proportion with the other. His hands seem a little bit smaller than this one. Not really much of a difference. So, like I was saying before, um, Mankind and the Spotlight, um, Mr. McMahon both come with the same belt. And uh, yeah, I think these fit in scale. I think he's supposed to be smaller than Mr. McMahon. So here is like that picture I showed before um, with the Mankind and uh, Triple H by his side. So uh, here's them together, or side by side. So this is an amazing figure. I recommend anyone, 
if you collect figures and you see this in a store, buy it. Uh, so a friend ordered this for me. So uh, yeah, he pre-ordered it. It just came in. So if anyone else's got pre-order, it should be coming in really soon. So uh, yeah, this this is just an amazing figure. So uh, next up on the checklist for the WWE, it's gonna be the SummerSlam exclusive. Um, just SummerSlam, I mean, uh, Finn Balor. Which was an amazing one. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.